Let's have a look at nutrition in plants. We know that plants manufacture their food by a process called carbon dioxide. This process involves the use of elements such as carbon dioxide and water in the presence of sunlight. Plants contain a green pigment called chlorophyll which is responsible for trapping the green, the sunlight's energy. This chlorophyll or green pigmentations because of cells within the body called chloroplasts. The chloroplasts are the ones actually responsible for producing the plant's food. When carbon dioxide, water and sunlight are used by the chlorophyll in the leaves, oxygen and glucose are formed. Have a look at the equation below. Carbon dioxide mixed with water in the presence of sunlight will end up releasing glucose and oxygen. This diagram shows you a typical, typical plant with a leaf. Carbon dioxide and water in the presence of sunlight produces food. This food, which is in the form of glucose, is taken up and distributed to the other parts of the plant. As it's shown on the left hand side, food goes down, which is basically to the roots, and then food goes up through the shoots to the other parts of the plant's body. As a result, the glucose can be further broken down and that food is stored in the form of starch within the plant's leaf. It can also be stored in the stems or shoots or even at times the roots. As a result, if you look, the output that you get when food is broken down and produced, oxygen is released. I hope you have enjoyed the presentations. If you'd like to see more presentations, you can always visit us on our website at www.arinjacademy.com. Furthermore, for a subscription, you could always check us out on Facebook at www.facebook.com slash academy. You can subscribe to us also on our YouTube channel at www.youtube.com slash C slash Academy. Thank you.